If you want to be amongst the top 1% of men, you are going to have to act like one first. And it all starts with setting goals. As a young man, you may dream of being a strong, independent, masculine man. Someone who owns the land he walks on. But the harsh truth is, most of you are never really taught about what real masculine energy really is. If I were to ask you right now what masculine energy is, you will give nothing but a stereotypical feel-good response. We are not here for that. Hence, let's get into the real answer. Masculine energy is the drive that craves freedom, that wants to destroy any chain that's holding it back. Interestingly enough, this is the opposite of feminine energy, which seeks submission. This is just one of the things which separates men and women. So as man, you are constantly trying to be free of something. You set up a plan in your mind, and you may not even be aware of this, but your mind always has a goal it's chasing. When you are actively doing work that progresses the goal, you feel fulfilled. But when you aren't making progress to those goals in your mind, that when you start despising yourself and feel like you're off track. Everyone is addicted to the technologies around them, to internet and social media. But when you become obsessed over your own goals, when you become addicted to making progress, that's when you start feeling on top of the world. That's when you get the true masculine feeling of being able to accomplish anything. Did you know that less than 1% of people write down their goals? You should feel proud of yourself when you enter that 1%. If you don't write down your goals right now, well, this new year, it's time you start writing it. Write down the specific goal that you are aiming to accomplish. I guarantee you that when you start noting these goals, when you start taking them out of your mind and bringing them into existence, you will see your life change. When your senses observe the ideas out in reality, it will automatically fire your brain up to start generating ideas and paths to success. Then it's up to you to start taking those harder choices that will achieve those important goals of yours. You will start to feel so good about yourself. You'll become more successful. You'll get more confident. All those things that you wanted like more friends, more girls, more confidence, you will get them when you start to set and achieve goals. It's crazy how so many people never write down their goals in life. It's like they're trying to keep themselves away from what they truly want in life. Goal setting is you choosing the direction of your future. To not set goals is to let other people, the world, the big corporations and software developers choose the direction of your future for you. Does that not show a severe lack of masculinity? Be honest with yourself. Are you happy with where you are in life right now? There are certain things that you can't change that have reduced your levels of masculinity. One of them being the education system. Being forced inside this system, being forced to learn subjects that you aren't even interested in, being sat down in a classroom and learning in a way that induces more femininity inside of you and less masculinity. Those are some things that you can't really change. It's up to the system right now, but to not take control of the things that you are entirely responsible for, that's a direct insult to yourself. Now, before you set out to write your goals, let me tell you about something even more important. Values. Before you settle on your goals, settle on some fundamental values first. Ask yourself and write down, what is it that you truly stand for? Are there levels you will not cross to get whatever you want? Where do you draw lines on things, and what are you willing to sacrifice for what you really need? These are things your values constitute of. You may not even be aware of them, but I assure you, you have a set of values you've internalized over the course of your life. It's your job to sit one day and bring them out. Not everything that comes to mind will be your honest, true value, but with time and death, you will surely uncover your truth, your reality. And those values you uncover are the foundation of your success. If you want to become the top 1% of men, it has to be propelled from inside of you. Hence, ask yourself, what is the most important thing for you? Spend an hour journaling your values and comparing different values against each other to see which one is truly your priority. Once you have your values in order of importance, it's very easy to now set goals that you're willing to achieve. In each area of your life, like your work life, mental health, physical health, social life, set specific goals that have very clear deadlines. 
There's one main thing that you have to do if you really want this to change your life. You have to commit to this. Become obsessed over these goals that you've written down. Write your goals down on paper, stick it up on your wall, wake up and read it like it's the most important part of your day. Become obsessed with your goals, talk about them, think about them, visualize them, brainstorm ideas. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to drop a like and comment your thoughts on the matter. Make sure you subscribe as we have a lot more videos coming out which will elevate your status in life. With that said, see you all soon.